so 56 children has been shot in Philadelphia. 56 is only me, man. A six-year-old boy just was shot. Got out the car, foaming out the mouth, right in West Philadelphia. He saw his dad get murdered right in front of him. They shooting women. They shooting children. And they do not care for human life. We in our community is suffering. Where is all of these protests? This is sad. Y'all think it's sad? Let me show you this. Look at this. Look at this. Fed up and frustrated over the gun violence epidemic. This afternoon, a six-year-old boy is fighting for his life after he was shot sitting in a car in West Philadelphia. His father was shot and killed right in front of him. It's out of control. I mean, what can you say? It's out of control. The hurtful thing is... It's women and kids getting shot. When you hear kids and women getting shot, you know what I mean? They, that's, that's, that's really hurtful. Thank you for joining us this afternoon. I'm Jacqueline London. And I'm Stefania Jimenez. The six-year-old boy is one of 56 children hit by gunfire in 2021. And to put that into perspective, you see that visual right there? That's about two full classrooms of students who have been personally victimized by gun violence so far this year. And the thing is, it's only mid-April. NBC 10's Danny Freeman is live outside police headquarters. So, Danny, what's the latest here? And what are people saying about this? The latest in this particular investigation is that we actually learned the identity of the father who was killed in that triple shooting last night. He's 28-year-old Joshua Butts. Meanwhile, his six-year-old boy, as you noted, still in the hospital. And folks we spoke with today are just devastated about this whole incident because they know that boy will now face trauma for the rest of his life. And not only takes it up a notch, but it just sickens me. It sickens all of us, and we're tired of seeing this, quite frankly. A chaotic scene spanning blocks last night in West Philadelphia. Gunshots fired into a parked car near a school before sunset. The driver tried to rush away before crashing down the street. A triple shooting, leaving a father dead and a six-year-old in the hospital. The kid jumped out the car, phoned me. You know what I mean? Out the mouth and everything. Today, crime scene tape and remnants of the awful night. And once again, a community in Philadelphia is left speechless. It's out of control. I, I mean, what can you say? It's out of control. Massio Shealy owns the auto repair shop next to where the crash happened. And he says it hurts so much when kids are involved. We're killing each other. I don't know why we're killing each other. That's what bothers me so much. That we're just killing each other in a rapid pace. So far this year, 56 children under the age of 18 have been shot in Philadelphia. 17 kids have been victims of homicides, which is up from five kids killed during the same time last year. All of us should, should be horrified. Aleda Garcia with the National Homicide Justice Alliance says she hopes new promises, plans, and investment from the city really does turn into action. There's always hope. There always has to be hope. But I also think that we, we can't sleep on this. Because waking up to more death is unbearable. Now do you believe it's self-hate? We are killing ourselves. Is it from the money? The lack of? At this point, everybody's speechless. Ain't nobody trying to take no initiative to do nothing or nothing. These young boys running around with these guns. You old niggas my age. You can't check your young boy. Then, nigga, you ain't no grown man, nigga. Don't you be in, go walk in the house. And all you niggas that want to leave instead of fix the problem. Oh, my homies, yeah, man. You know, that's why I left. You a bitch, nigga. That's why you left, nigga. You don't want to be the help, nigga. Your family here, you left, but your family here dying. You a hoe. And this is how I feel. Ain't no goddamn editing, nothing. I ain't playing no music, none of that bullshit, man. Y'all need to hear this, man. I don't respect you, young boy. You 130 pounds, nigga. Yeah, you can shoot me, but you can't beat me, though. 
You can't beat me, dog. Y'all niggas don't got no hands, man. You ain't never made a nigga get a tomato soup mouth, nigga. You get your ass whooped and want to kill somebody. Niggas a shame, a disgrace, nigga. Fuck y'all.